it's Whimsy and we're back today with another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. We are going to do a couple of side quests again, I think, and then a main quest which is called the Helm of Earthcott, I think. Previously, we saw how to take care of beasts, which was super fun, and we saw High Wing, the Hippogriff, and it was just amazing. I really love that part of the game and I'm excited to see more, so yeah, let's jump into it. Okay. We could return to Albi because we beat Imelda at her own game. <laughs> well, it's not really a game, but you know what I mean. So we can definitely go back to him for that. Um, I saw uh, someone's comment saying that it's up to a certain altitude that the boost doesn't work. I think. So if I do like this, it should keep boos boosting because I'm still low to the ground. Yeah. On the broom. But if I go higher then it will eventually uh, not boost at all times. There we go, see? So I didn't know that. Um, and the comment was done after I played last time, so... It was on another video, I don't remember which one, but yeah. So thank you for telling me that, I did not realize that at all. I don't know if the game told me, probably, but you know, as a first playthrough... I miss a lot of things because I talk to you guys, I'm trying to focus on the gameplay, I'm trying to form thoughts and then be coherent. English is not my first language. I know it all sounds like excuses, but it is true. It is true that streaming a game it's, is not like streaming or filming. It's not like playing it on your own. And also a first play too, you're bound to miss something. So I hope that you guys were not too... Um, frustrated with me i'm very sorry if, if that was the case i mean it's just a broom detail it's it's not that frustrating i guess but anyway i just wanted to explain a little bit in case you guys were like wondering why i'm not necessarily understanding everything like on on the go like this like even right now you know i'm talking to you guys and I had to realize, oh yeah, I just I just aggroed an enemy. Which kind of enemy is it? Wait, there's a juning feed. What, what was it? At the same time that I'm talking to you guys. So it's always like that when we when we play a game on YouTube, we look a little bit scatterbrained and I think it's it's just normal. You have to think about that sort of stuff when you watch someone play a game. And I'm not saying all that because the person that commented that was super nice. I'm, I'm not I'm not saying that uh, you guys are not, but sometimes, especially on other games, Hogwarts Legacy is not that bad, but sometimes on other games, uh, people watching can be very, very um, harsh in their criticism on first play tools, in my opinion. It's it's been going super well with Hogwarts Legacy though. I can already say that this is probably probably going to be my favorite playthrough on the channel. I just love the game so much and you guys are simply amazing. The community is the best. Like I and I feel like there's a lot of newcomers, people that are not usually gamers, but now they discover other let's players and discovered this game because they love Harry Potter and yeah I'm just it just makes me happy to welcome newcomers like that and welcome people that are not usually gamers and it just makes a really sweet and innocent community I don't know how to explain this I don't want to sound like arrogant like I'm but you know I'm used to playing games I play games every day I do this as part of my living income and you know I'm I'm kind of used to playing games I'm not a veteran or anything and I'm not the best at games either but it's just so sweet to have comments sometimes that are like, I'm not a gamer, I never play games, but I play this because it's Harry Potter, and that's just that just warms my heart, and it makes the community nice. I don't know. Back from your Anyways. latest slide. I want to hear yes. all the particulars. That was a very long rant and absolutely not coordinated. <laughs> Good news, Mr. Sometimes Weeps. I go on tangents. With your upgrade, I was able to set a new record at the Eindel course. Brilliant! 
I knew the upgrade had fantastic potential. How did your broom feel? It rides well. Does get a tad shaky at top speed, and the handle wobbles a bit when I hit a strong gust of wind. Ah, yes. Hmm, I see. I think I know how to address that. Nice. Thank you. I owe you one. If it means another upgrade, the pleasure's all mine. You there sound we go. as determined as I am to improve broom flight. It's a joy to have a collaborator like yourself. If I'm right, and I do hope I am, you'll be hearing good news from me soon. Nice. So as, as again, last truly. time, we don't get immediate the what immediate upgrade, but later we might, so... Mr. Weeks later we will, actually. Team. Let's sell a couple of things that we don't actually need because they are not better than what we got already. But we can keep the appearances as always. I will keep this one because of the anti-venom for now. And the laceration damage as well. I'm kind of... I kind of want to try that out. In the wild. I want to try that out in the wild. Okay. Now, what do we do? Because we still have... So many quests. Oh, we can do the Sirona. We're in... Uh, we're already in... Um, in Hogsmeade, so... I think I should go buy some Wigan Weld. I know I can make some. I know, but I would have to go back to the rumor requirement or to Professor Sharp's class and then wait and then make them. I am a lady of impatience, okay? I prefer going around the world, discovering and buying. Hello there. In the market for. Thank you again for delivering those potions to Madame Give Wally. me some Wigan Weld. Save me a lot of time and trouble. There we go. A wise decision. Thank you. Okay. Bye. I hope to see you again. Farewell so now we have now. 11. That's not too bad. Let's go to the three broomstick. Can we actually get some of the... I'm going to do the demi guys. I'm planning a um, a live stream on YouTube this Thursday actually, so I'm going to do the demi guys stuff then I think, and other side quests. I mean, we have so many. Let Let's look at the quest for a moment. Look at that. Like we have a lot of stuff we can do and assignments as well. I, I guess we're gonna do some today, but still, like. We, I think we'll have a lot to do, especially the the uh, demo guys for Alohomora. Oh, I need to speak to Nelly for the Dedalian Keys to finish that quest. Okay. I could do the butterflies in the Forbidden Forest for the live stream as well. So, you know, we have a lot of things we can do, which is cool for a live stream. Oh, please. Hello Hi, Sirona. Nice to see you. Hello, Miss Ryan. I wanted to thank you again for your help with Rookwood and Harlow the day of the troll attack. Serona, please. And I was happy to help. Oh, those two are nothing but trouble. Glad you and your friend were here when they found you. I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lodgog. He's a friend. <laughs> How can you trust that goblin? Jesus. It seemed as though you were on good terms with him. That. I've known him for years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't she friends bought the then. Place. Isn't His that amazing? mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now. We are. I hadn't seen him in years when he came in a few months ago. But he recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. It took them a second to realize I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Not all goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. Lodgok is as worried as the rest of us about what's been going on. In that case, I'd like to talk with him. About Ranrock in particular. Where might I find him? I assume your interest is to do with the rumors I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend Rookwood. It is. If he's not here, you might find him doing business at the Hog's Head. He's a trusted metal trader. You should mention that we spoke. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards. Even ones as young as you. Hmm. That said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him in, you'll find an ally in Lodgok. 
Have you heard what Ranrock and Rookwood are working on together? Not much Just more checking than if the everything fact is they recording. seem to have some okay. sort of uneasy alliance. Friendship between wizards and goblins is rare enough, but between those two, they each want something the other has. I can guarantee it. That said, I fear they're like a two-headed serpent. Both will need to be taken down to stop whatever scheme they've been plotting. You seemed unfazed by Rookwood and Harlow the yeah. other day. They don't scare you. Really They're unfazed. Bullies. Plain and simple. Mm. Never tolerated them in my own life, and certainly mm. won't tolerate them going after my friends. Nice. Don't misunderstand me. They're dangerous wizards and shouldn't be trifled with. They should, however, be confronted and reminded, whenever possible, that the rest of us have each other's backs. I like her. Thank you, no, Serena. I love if her. If you find Lord Gog, she's amazing. Please give him my best. I don't know what you've done so, to make such powerful enemies, but please watch your back. I don't know if because she said that some of our classmates Hope didn't recognize talk about her. You taking down that troll in the village circle. You certainly made an impression. Can I talk to her again or yeah. Might I ask you some questions, oh. Serena? Of course you can. Oh, I already asked. Sorry, them. never mind. If you find Lord Gog Please. Give I me wonder my best. if she had not transitioned yet when she was in Hogwarts. And that's what she means by like some of her classmates like didn't recognize her or something. Okay. Um let me change my clothes, I think. I really like this Gryffindor attire, but we are going on an adventure. Right? So I think this is the appropriate... Oh, I'm almost... Uh, almost the, uh, at level 25, I think. Ooh! Getting closer, eh? <laughs> okay. Let's go to Hogshead! And I'm so excited! I'm so excited to go! Because it... It appears in the movies, but also in the books, or should I say in the books, but also in the movies. You too, um, And it's actually a very important place, Hug's Head. That's where Harry, Hermione, Ron make their first um, Dumbledore's Army reunion. It's not called Dumbledore's Army yet, actually, but, um, well, I don't think it is. At that point, but that's where the all sign. That's also where they end up in the seventh book when they want to go back to Hogwarts. And it's actually Dumbledore's brother, uh, Abelfort, that is the head of, I mean, the um, owner of Hogshead. Head? I can't speak. Abelfort is the owner of Hogshead when they're alive uh i don't think he's alive yet maybe soon to be born but he's not alive yet so i don't know who's the owner right now but yeah it's basically it's the three broomstick but for adults like older <laughs> you know like it's a bit darker and anyway i'm really excited to go in and see what it looks like Welcome yeah the there we go and the empty seat is yours. look at that Looks so cool. And that's what we see in the intro. Uh, not the intro, but the menu screen. We see that head. Mounted hog's head. Um, this mounted hog's head rolls its eyes and snuffles its nose as it oversees the city atmosphere and decidedly interesting clientele of hog's head. Yeah. Ah, there we go. Level 25. What do we have here? A demi guys. Oh, wait, really? Are you serious? But it's not night yet. Oh, hello. It's not night time. Nah. Hello, sir. Uh, there we are. Okay. Can you pass the time in this game? I never actually... Noticed if you can. Wait.
Mind now, demiguys? You can. Oh. That's perfect. That's perfect! Rebellion. Hugshead docks. Outside the Hugshead in offer a pleasant place to sit and relax if one can do whiles only a stone's throw from whatever nefarious going ons may be occurring in a notoriously shady inn yeah it's shady that's what i i was searching for earlier the uh the proper wording for this place like i didn't mean old people go there necessarily like there is no age for the three broomstick or hugs head well i guess there is for Hogshead? Nah, not really. Well, students don't really go there. They're not supposed to. It's too shady. <laughs> you know. Okay. We can go talk to him. You look familiar. Hello, Lord Gok. Sorona said I might find you here. She did, did she? Did she send you with news? No, actually, I wanted to speak with you. She gives you it's her best, Ranrock. though. Now I remember. The three broomsticks. Day of the troll attack. You're the student he's after. I am. And I need to know what he and his loyalists are up to. So I can stay a step ahead. Let's say I did know. Why should I trust you? Serona trusts me. And she said she thought our interests may be aligned. Hmm. I'm curious what the other well, answer is. Well, if Serona trusts you... As a dialogue. Very well. I may know like, of I'm something that could help us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. Oh, okay. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. Ranrock and I had a, a falling out a while back. The relic could well repair the chasm between us. Very well. I'll retrieve the relic if you promise to share Ranrock's plans with me. We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not abscond with the relic, and you, that I'll share what I learn. Hmm. Gather whatever supplies you may need and meet me near the witch's tomb. Which is where? You didn't say. Interesting. Can I talk to you? Rebellion. No? Okay. Level two. Level two. What about e three, us? even. Okay, then. Um, before we do that, I think I actually want to. Mind now, demi guys. Oh, wait, really? Rebellion. Wait. Where? <laughs> she says that, but I don't know, eh? Uh, up there. I think. Okay. Oh, well. Let's forget about it. I can't go in. I cannot go in. to do Revelio. wait that's weird I don't know wait that's weird why is it like Revelio. this huh maybe it's for a, a later quest I don't know Strange. Very strange. Okay. Anyways, I think we'll do some assignments first. Um. Let me see. Because I could do flying near the spires. I'm not sure what that is, but I want to do a resto momentum. So. 
let's try to do that. Maybe I can just... Is it in Hogwarts? Or World? Oh, here. Oh, goodness. Okay. Um, yeah, I want to do the clock. I'm pretty sure the clock has to do with the rest of momentum. So, um... I need to fly near... Oh, okay, I think I see. So, oh, I missed. I think it's on the other side. Oh, that's nice. There we go. That's all, right? Okay. Cool. Wait, there's a Merlin's trial, I think, right here. Rebellion. I know what right that means. Here. Merlin trial. Yep. Maybe with Akio. I need the little Rebellion. balls. <laughs> we have some here. Accio. Oh, no, it's a place to put them. Oh, okay. Let me grab my broom. It's going to be easier. Ah. So we should break that and then... Here. Like this. Come here. Nice. After that. Oh, we have another? Or is it the same? It's the same one. Okay. Revelia. Mm. Mm. Ah. There are some here. What happened? The patient's symptoms include pockmarked skin of greenish hue, sparks sneeze from the nostril in green. Oh, that's a uh, dragon pox, I think. Rash between the toes. Textbook case of dragon pox. Yep. Yeah. Possibly lethal. I have prescribed a second dose of Gore's more cure, but it may not be sufficient. As such, I have further dis prescribed an elixir to induce euphoria to ease the patient's probable passing. Must sanitize my equipment. Highly contagious. I think in that time they didn't have a cure yet. They might, and feel free to let me know if Rebellion. I'm wrong here because I am not 100% sure. But I think that in the Harry Potter years, they have a cure for dragon pox. But in that time, they might not have, which makes sense. Oh goodness, okay, wait. Come here. Only one. Oh boy. Oh, it's working. Kinda. Oh, goodness. Come on. Really? Oh, we have a glitch. Maybe I can uh, kill them again. Oh, we have a glitch, guys. Oh, no. Whoa! Okay, it's working. Thank God. I thought I was fucked. <laughs> Oof, that was stressful. Okay. Um. Uh. 
Hmm. Where else? We have a chest here at least. Which is always interesting. Revelio. Hmm. Where are the other balls? I feel like I'm super far now. This one is hard, eh? Ah! Oh. Here. Come here. There we go. I think that's it now. Yeah. I could do all that in this stream, though. It's not very interesting for you guys. <laughs> I gotta say. Okay. <laughs> mm um. Should I do another quest before going back to Madame K Kogawa? Uh, oh, I need to go to her biology class as well. Is what I need to do. Okay, so let's go back to her. Isn't she gonna be sleeping? <laughs> I'm gonna be like, hey, I need a rest of momentum, thank ya. <laughs> I like. It. Might not be preferable. Oh well, let's try it. Hello. You're not sleeping. Welcome back. Have you Reporting back, Professor. Assignments all finished. Well done. Shows good discipline. Thank Wisdom you. Wisdom is a golden snitch, as they say. <laughs> and you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard. Nice. Let us practice our restore momentum. A charm, incidentally, created to stop quaffles from plummeting straight to the ground during a Quidditch match. Precise, deliberate movements. There we go. Nice. And it's a yellow one. That's good because we didn't have a lot of yellows. Yeah. Okay. Very good. Um, I what? recommend practicing your new spell as much <laughs> as possible. Perhaps before you leave here. Yeah, with the with the books. Okay. So Hmm. Maybe I'll keep. Ugh. This is difficult. I don't really use those much. So I think I should put some attack ones here. Attack. <laughs> you know what I mean? Or maybe. Huh. Maybe if I put like this and then Akio the pole so and then here I could put like this <laughs> it's like four spell slot is not enough anymore actually <laughs> actually it's not enough anymore because I guess I could use those spells um, while being invisible. Arrest in the 
That's it. <sighs> Keep it up. <gasps> it is so cute. Well done. You are on your way to mastering Arresto Momentum. Nice. Professor, do you have a moment? Yes, what is Can it? Can I ask her some questions? So you Quidditch class, team, she was on I it, you for sure. The Toyohashi Quidditch team. I did. The Toyohashi Tengu are from Japan. Yeah. Dominant. Yeah. Known for their rigorous training. Of course. They practice near the Mahutokoro School of Magic. Often battling both tempestuous seas and violent storms Mahu. <laughs> in addition to each other. Tournament play is almost always easier for the Tengu than their training sessions. I take it you're a fan. Fan? <laughs> I was being groomed to play on their team. Oh. And I would have been a Tengu if not for a bit of bad luck. I know that feeling. Some things are simply out of our control. Mm, and some things are in it. I should have known better. I made my own luck. What does that mean? I was betrayed what by someone I trusted. Myself. I did not see clearly and I paid a dear price. My best friend Asuka and I were being groomed to play on the team together. I as keeper and she as chaser. She was breathtaking. She once corkscrewed through three players and scored before they even turned their heads. But as trials so cool. for the Tengu got closer, she panicked. I did not realize the extent of her panic until it was too late. She wanted so desperately for both of us to play together that she had slipped Felix Felicis into oh, our team no. before we were to show them our skills. Oh no, that's prohibited. Liquid luck? That's illegal, isn't yeah. it? It is indeed. I knew within minutes that something was different. I had never played so well. And Asuka was playing more beautifully than I had ever seen. When I confronted her afterwards, she admitted what she had done. I withdrew from consideration immediately. But it wasn't your fault. You didn't know about the potion in the tea. It does not matter. My flying that day was not my own. Mm. I could not live with myself. Damn, so she's cool. I withdrew and explained to them why. I burned my broom in disgrace. Goodness what happened gracious. to Asuka? Did she burn her broom as well? Asuka played for the Tengu for two seasons. You didn't report her? Tell them what she'd done? Her fate was not mine to decide. Holy my shit, she's is cool. in my hands. As your fate is in yours. Thank you, Professor. Damn! I shall remember what you've told me. That's a true fucking G. Holy. I'm sorry. That's very cool. She gained all my 100% respect. She is amazing. I just hope I could do the same. You know what I mean? Like, you, you think you would do the same, but if you were in her shoes, would you, though? Like, that's the question. I hope I would. But damn, that's tough. It's your dream. And it's not even your fault. And you still decide to be true to yourself and be like, I, I can't compete today. I would have fought, though. I would have been like, someone spiked my drink. It was not, I don't know who it was, but like someone spiked my drink. I know I have Felix Felicis because I feel weird or whatever. I feel ab abnormal today and I don't think I should compete. But please, can I compete another day? And you can test me or whatever. I don't mind, but you know what I mean? I would have fought, but you know, she's Japanese. So obviously she, it's honor first and, and all this and all that, the culture. But you know, damn, that's cool. I don't know if you guys knew, but I, I'm, I, I'm no expert on Japanese culture because of this, but I lived in Japan for a year um, when I was in university. <gasps> Best year ever, honestly. And it's not that Japan is a perfect country at all. I got to witness firsthand by, by living there for a year that I actually would never be able to live in Japan. Um, always. Like, as I thought I could, but... 
after a year, I was like, yeah, no, <laughs> I cannot. There are many things that, that are not suitable for me in, in that country. But I still have Japan really, really dear to my heart. I think it's an amazing country, amazing culture, language. Everything is so interesting and so different from me and my culture, right? I live in Canada. I'm from Quebec and it's completely different. It's, it's, it's amazing to go there. I highly recommend to everyone who can at least go once in their life in Japan because you have all the security you would get from a, a, like my country, Canada, even more sometimes. Uh, like uh, there's, there's practically no stealing and stuff like that. Like it's not really in the culture. There is still, but it's very safe. But you get the culture shock all the same. It's crazy. It's comfortable and safe, but culture shock is really intense because the <laughs> whole culture is different from mine at least and oh. yeah it was just a an amazing uh, did you need help sir <laughs> mind where you're going mind where you're going um and yeah i think it was it, yeah. it's one of the best experiences i've ever had going there i lived in a house with 15 other girls uh, and we all came from different different countries. Nobody came from the same country. And I learned so much that year. I learned so much. And I was so good at Japanese. I could speak it, understand it all. And, and now I've been back. It was almost a decade ago that I did that. And now I forgot everything. Well, not everything, but like... I forgot a lot from my Japanese. You know. As is bound to happen. Oh my goodness. Hello. Arrest them. Arrest them. Revelia. That's so cool. I think they only move at night, no? I've never seen them move like this before. Arrest the momentum. Yeah, it doesn't work on everything, eh? Um. Revelio. I know I'm not going the right way at all. But I'm just... I'm just going around. Uh, but yeah, it it was just it was just such an incredible experience, and I'm so privileged that I've been able to live that because I mean I understand that it's not everybody's, not everybody can have the, such an an occasion and the money as well. It was quite expensive. I had those debts for a really long time. Revelia. <laughs> it was <laughs> it was really expensive. <gasps> Aloha more. Okay. Um. There we go. Easy. Revelia. Okay, so where am I going now? That's a big trolley. Eh? Holy. Demi guys, Niffler. Okay, let me do this. Um. Uh, 12, 13, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 22. This one, and then where is the other one, though? Revelia. It's here. Um, this plus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven? No, no, put this. Uh, one, eight. I'm sorry. So it's one. It's uh, the unicorn. <laughs> sorry, it's easier for me to count in French. Rebellion. 
Gorgon portrait. I know I'm painting of a beautiful Gorgon and her suitor, whose eyes are wisely averted as he bends to kiss her hand. It is said that the artist who painted this accidentally gazed at his subject when he delivered a painting and is now forever a sculpture in the garden in Greece. <gasps> a Gorgon! Very cool. Is that Merlin? Might be. A hippogriff. I want that statue. <gasps> a werewolf. I want to put that in my... Uh, a centaur. Wait. I want all of those. I want those in my room of requirement. I only have a uh, unicorn, which is cool. And I have a... Um, a bird. Ugh, another centaur. Holy... They look so good. Oh. This one. Uh, I have a similar like this, I think. Very nice. <gasps> a test troll! Sorry. Rebellion. Let's keep on keeping on. <laughs> Wait, where am I now? I kind of recognize this place, isn't it? You know where um, Harry is looking for Peter Pettigrew? And then he is going around with Lumos. at night like this and then the portrait is like... Like, turn off your fucking wand. Well, not saying that, but you know what I mean. Put that light out. Sorry. And then Severus Snape appears. It looks like this kind of corridor. Ah, easy. Revelio. Here you are. Lumos. Come here. The little Niffler. Give me. Like this one. Wouldn't he say like... Oh, would you put the light away? <laughs> Are you deaf? Put that light out. <laughs> We're trying to sleep here. We were Rebellion. Using on the state of affairs. I don't even find her interesting. She's a bore. A dreadful bore. Oh, goodness. Okay, this looks ominous. Like... That's a door. <laughs> Wait, where? Okay, I've been here. No? Well, uh, for sure, but... Oh, not peeves. I'm not sure where I am right now. What are you doing, peeves? Oh, it's the... Okay. It's Professor Sharps. Okay. It's the potion. My god. I think there were dogs here. So the green greenhouse is just there. Yeah. Perfect. What if I do this? No. Yes. It doesn't work. <laughs> it doesn't work. Let's go see Professor Gardic. And I have a couple of plants that I could certainly grow. I need more cabbages. Chomping cabbages. So interesting. This one. <laughs> How wonderful to see you again. I I can only do the tiny leaves and Okay, wait. Empty. Yeah, I need Purchase from dogweed or dead cap. 
Magic knee. Dogweed or dead cap? <gasps> what? Okay. Oh. What's up with that? Strange. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be too. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank, Thank you, you, Professor. Professor Hecket tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Wingardium, Wingardium Levioso requires a bit of concentration and a nice graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. When executed correctly, you should be able to pick up boulders as though they were sprigs of sneezewort. Wingardium Leviosa. Not Leviosa. Okay. Levitate and move objects. Oh, that's nice. Fine tune distance and. Oh, well done. sick. Feel free to practice Wingardium Leviosa. Uh, I'm sorry. Okay, I have. Oh my god. Uh, I should put another here. Uh, Wingardium Levios. Where is it? Wait, I can. I don't have to attribute it. Oh, there it is. Okay. Why is it not an essential? <laughs> I guess I should put it here then. Because these are like my combat things. <laughs> Things. This one is not combat. Okay, let's try it out. In the greenhouse, I've set some crates up. Pure and natural. Oh, nice. Oh wow. Okay. Amazing. Professor Garlic, a moment yeah, of can your I time? ask her about the her life? Resting, Maybe? So now's as good a time as any. There we I go. was wondering, what made you want to teach herbology? How lovely of you to ask. I've always had an affinity for greenery, so this situation is a bit of a dream she's nice. come true. She's a bit After cringy, but she's nice. I was I thrilled see. to be asked to step in for my old herbology professor. He'd had a slight accident, you see. Oh dear. A shame for him, but it worked out well for you. <laughs> he never cared. Really cared for the plants, and they could sense it. Oh. oh. You'd be surprised how perceptive a plant can be. At any rate, the trouble began one day when he cut into a wigan tree. Unfortunately for him, its leaves were hiding a bow truckle. Oh. You may recall the marvellous creatures that yeah. resemble a twig. The little beast gouged the professor's eyes quite fiercely. <laughs> but terrifying, I'd imagine. Yeah. Uh, likely for the professor, too. And that's when you took over as the herbology professor? Well, not quite. After three weeks at St. Mungo's, my predecessor regained a tiny bit of his eyes. It's more like a fantastic beast, no? On a more to the greenhouse. Within a week, he had... He claims by accident kicked a Chinese chomping cabbage, so it was back to St. Mungo's for him. <laughs> Fair bit of bad luck there, I'd say. Hmm. Well, I felt awful for him, but I dare say I felt a bit more sympathy for the cabbage. Upon his discharge <gasps> from the hospital, his indifference to plants had turned to utter disdain. 
he lost what little patience he had left with a particularly temperamental venomous tentacula and, well, his resulting leave of absence continues to this day. Yeah, he, he went fuck this shit. I'm glad everything worked out as it did. <laughs> it ain't for and me. And that you're the herbology <laughs> professor now. Very kind of you to say. I do love these gardens and helping my students grow. Huh. Lovely speaking with you. Have a wonderful day. Oh, and remember, I love her hair. Be kind to your Wigan trees. And the um the Botrocol also live in uh, the trees used for wand making. So you gotta oh, be nice careful to when you, you cut those to make wands. Because the botrocol are like, no, it's my house, bitch. They're really cute too. Okay. We have Professor Onai. Um. I kind of want to do the main quest, I think. Yeah, let's do the main quest. In... <laughs> I had a... <laughs> what am I doing? In Hogsmeade. No, isn't it in Hogsmeade? It's not in Hogsmeade. It is here. Oh, interesting. I want to fight a little bit. It's been a while that I haven't. So, let's go. Woo! So excited. A castle. Must have been quite stately in its time. Going fast. <sighs> there we go. Hello, sir. I'm ready. Ooh. Good. There's no time to Ooh. Lose. What precisely is the relic I'm to retrieve? A valuable heirloom known as the Helmet of Ertgot. The witch considered herself a collector and purchased the helmet as a trinket. She cared not what pain she caused the goblins. Goblins believe that the rightful owner of any object is its maker, not its purchaser. Yeah. Wizard kind sees things differently. Mm. It's a wonder goblins and wizards have ever been able to work together. The differences between our kinds are myriad. They seem to be. It may surprise you to know that I do not believe those differences always to be insurmountable. It is the reason I find myself traveling with you to this tomb today. Nice. Can we go faster? Yes, thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, I did this. <gasps> Beautiful. Need this for my rumor requirement, which I never go to. I should go back, make more wig and weld. Well, I have eleven. That's not too bad, but it's so quick too to make, and I have two stations now. I should make more. But you guys told me during the live stream, uh, and there it is. That I need which to be careful too. because the uh, room will change. Looking place, isn't it? As I go through the story and then it will destroy everything I did so I'm waiting a little bit for that reason interesting Ooh. I wish you luck retrieving his the eyes are awesome As a wand carrier you should have an advantage now before you set off do you have any questions what about this helmet makes it so special the Helmet of Ertgot is an ancient and storied relic, forged during a time of unity among the goblin clans. It inspired greatness, that is, until it was no longer ours. Then it became something else. A symbol of what has been lost, of all that wizard kind has taken from us. The 
Reclaiming it would mean a great deal to goblin kind and to Ranrock. He would be grateful to me should I return it. It seems Ranrock and Rookwood are conspiring. Why would that be? I had heard this. When the dark-hearted conspire, they seldom make their full intentions clear to one another. I can only speculate, but I imagine hmm. their alliance is uneasy and quite fragile. Let us hope that ours is less so. Don't suppose you have any idea what could be waiting for me inside the tomb? Considering a dark witch was involved, I suppose there's a chance you may encounter the dark protectors, known as Inferi. Oh, okay, cool. The Thank you. The foul creatures thrive on darkness and the cold. Vanquish them with light, force, and most effectively, fire. Nice. It all seems clear to me now that we're here. I do hope our alliance proves fruitful. Again, I wish you luck. Okay. I will remain here. Fire. Eagerly <laughs> awaiting your return. Please, be careful. Fall. I'm sorry. Ooh. Revelio. Okay, let's go. Ooh. The light is coming on on its own, eh? It's sealed. Lulos. Oh, goodness. Okay. Moss. Curious. Where's the other one? Revelio. There we go. Malin's beard. Revelio. All right. Oh. Unidentified. Okay. Okay, this is gonna fall on me sooner or later. Revelia. Hmm. Okay. Revelia. This can't be the witch's tomb. Likely I need to go further. Yeah. Lumos. Let's take all of this. I think. Yeah. Revelio. Lumos. All right. Rebellion. Okay. I have a feeling I'm not alone here. Oh, I see them. There we go. Maybe if I use Confringo, I think it would work. Confringo. Yeah. Oh, I'm full. Come and find me in the greenhouse. <laughs> Professor Garlic, this is not the time. Okay. Jesus. Was that hitless? It was. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh my god, that was stressful. Huh? Oh. 
Huh. Oh, come on. Really? Ah. I think... Wait. This one. Oh, come on. Can you please? Thank you. Oh, can't I go on it? I can't. Okay. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Shit. I don't know. Rebellion. Huh. What to do to go there? Huh. Ah! Excuse me? I didn't know you were Spider-Man? Huh. 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 It's because of the... Uh, this? I don't know how to call. I don't have the English word right now. The fans? It's not really a fans. Uh, we would say grillage, okay? In French. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. I think I should. Okay. I see how it is. We'll do this first. Hmm. If I could and power then this. it somehow, it looks like it could be rotated. Yeah. Uh. Wait, it didn't. Yeah. Lumos. Okay. Uh, maybe. Mm, there we go. Easy. Lumos. Come here. Ow. You. You. And you. Okay. We're doing fine. <laughs> I'm stressed. Revelia. Oh! Wait a damn minute. Where does this go? Okay, I guess that's... No? Okay. Platform closer, but how? And more. It's it's Accio, not we Guardian Leviosa. What do you mean? Oh. Okay, so it does. Oh, that's interesting. It does win Guardian Leviosa. After I Accio. Oh, that's pretty cool. Perhaps Accio. <gasps> oh, goodness. What the fuck am I doing? Okay. Ooh.
Okay. That didn't work. Let's put them all back up, I guess. No? What am I supposed to do? I mean, I get it, but... Usually it places all on its own. Am I gonna be able to get away? I know, I know I'm supposed to put it like... Oh goodness gracious. I can go back here? Okay. Let's try again. Okay. Oh boy. I'm sorry. Okay. All right. Is that... Jesus. I had a lot of trouble doing that. Revelia. Okay, whatever. Whatever, I guess we got it. <laughs> I'm not... Oh, that's so weird. Okay. Th these are the weirdest for sure. I had another... Uh, before, in another episode. What's that hanging there? Looks broken. Down I go. Another way. Oh well, I'm sorry. I cut Revelia. your... Uh... Take everything we can. Rebellion. Okay, and then that's the way I came. I can go down and I can go here. Everything we can, and then come here. Yeah, it does. When Guardian Leviosa immediately after Akio, I don't know if I said that correctly uh, earlier, but yeah. Ooh, a telescope. All righty. Okay. 
Uh, yeah, but I should go. How do I go? It's sealed shut from the other side. Hmm. I guess we're going. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why not? Can I unseal? Yes. Unseal. Hello. Shortcut. Okay. Let's continue. What an adventurer we're making of ourselves. Look at us. Revelia. Puzzles are plenty. <laughs> Give me oh what's going on? Oh goodness. No? Jesus. it was going to be a yellow but it wasn't god damn oh well first hit of the day Lumos. um here for sure okay we have another there we have the door Avelio. We have another there. Okay. Let me see what I can do. Lumos. Hmm. That's gonna tough. Oh, are you kidding me? Come on. Okay. Revelia. <laughs> Let me just go here first. Revelia. Just to see what's up. Damn, we get a lot of stuff. I'm gonna be full soon, I think. Maybe. Lumos. Wait. Oh, <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. I need to do it twice, I think, like many, many times. Closer. Yeah. This looks even more complex. Lumos. 
Okay. That's why. Mm-hmm. Interesting. I see. Lumos. I see how it is. Easy. <laughs> And then... Uh -huh. How am I gonna do this? Because there isn't another, right? I'm not mistaken. Making this spin ought to raise that platform. That must be it. How do I Lumos. take it out? Wait, I know. Lumos. But it's not gonna work anymore. Huh. Revelio. Wait, there's another one? Oh, there's another one? Oh, well. Lumos. Alright then. I thought there wasn't another, and I was like, wait, how am I gonna do this? Turns out there is one here. <laughs> I'm so dumb. I was like, wait, this is going to be complicated. But no, not at all. Revelia. Sorry, this took me a while. The witch's final resting place. Lord Gog said the helmet was in her sarcophagus. Uh -huh. Okay, some people tried to come the here. The dead Ashwinder. Your compatriots must have made off with the helmet. Lord Gok won't like this. Goodness. Better show this to Lord Gok. Si sign it? There must be some sort of mechanism for this doorway. Ring. Revelio. I'm just checking if I'm missing anything. Oh, easy. Okay. That was fun. The end fairies are not too uh, hard to beat. Not too hard at all. I'm OP. My character is OP. <laughs> Lodcock, the sarcophagus has been raided. I found no helmet. Only a dead Ashwinder. Damn, they got here first. We need to get it before Rookwood uses it to further ingratiate himself to Ranrock. I saw one of their campsites not far from here. Oh, nice. But I fear you must go in alone. My fighting days are behind me. That's fine. I'll head there now. Good. There's no time to lose. Get to that helmet before Rookwood does, or we will lose our chance at any leverage, no matter how I wonder if I, I chose help, if I would get like to Sebastian or something. To think those wretched thieves have their hands on such a relic. Mm 
Revelio. Hmm. A lot of stuff around here. Revelio. Did I do this thing? Ow. I don't know if I did this after all. What's up with this? Oh, I'm sorry. But I can see that he's holding. And there's so many of these around. I just find it weird. I saw that during stream, and I was like, what's up with this? Incendio. Oh! Pavelio. Okay, another here. Incendio. Is that what I'm... I'm so confused right now. Huh. What the freak? Allow me to put you perfect target practice. break all of them that's what i thought but i was not sure i'm sorry i'm not doing the main quest um i was just really curious about this wait what, what, what was written shit i don't know what was written fuck and it was long too oh dark hearts battle arena Okay. Another pitiful. Oh goodness. You're the one who released me. Oh goodness gracious. Okay. I've seen you all. Well work on me. Novice fuck. What has something done with you? I have I have the unforgivables right now excuse me you'll answer for this nobody will believe I defeated an ashwinder by myself 
Enjoy suffering, do you? Why are ya? I didn't mean. What am I doing here? I'll have to try not to make this too Nobody will miss one meeting student. Oh, goodness. I've seen your match, and I'm not going The fuck is this? Holy! Okay, let's try to do like waves after waves. Let's try to not die. Mainly. Now that I saw that I'll I have. You wish you were back at there we go. <laughs> Goodness gracious, I pressed too many things at the same time. I did. Huh? Oh. Wait till Sebastian hears about this. An Ashwinder. Amazing. What do you mean? Holy moly. Oh, 
to do oh goodness okay awesome What do you mean? Also, again, please, thank you. No. 
God, I don't have any Wigan Weld anymore. Oh, goodness. No, no. <laughs> Please. What did I do? No! Which one is that? Oh, God. That ain't good. I need to use Avada Kedavra on the trolls. I need to redo the whole thing. I cannot stop until I finish this. Dude. Should gain back like this. <gasps> no, not up there. That's unfair. I can't reach. Give me that. I need to gain as much as I can with this, this troll. Okay. There we go. Now I'm full. I have four <laughs> Wigan Weld. I'm gonna use Imperio, then Crucio, then kill the troll. No, I'm gonna use the Imperio on the troll if I can. Then Crucio. I'm not sure. You should never have come here. Imperial. Okay, oh, like that's good. Okay, get away. Okay. 
go slow. Oof. Oof. Okay. Okay. Whoa. the end oh my god <laughs> that was so hard <laughs> like holy okay so we got to practice and now i have one wig and weld of course so that's what it was Fight waves of enemies in this battle arena with the unforgivable curse of the Kedavra Imperio in Crucial as well as the Blasting Curse Confringo. In addition to their unique and devastating effects, unforgivable curses break through all shield charms. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> so they give us a taste. I'm guessing. They kind of like give us a taste and then later Rebellion. later they're they're gonna gi like give it to us or give us a choice maybe something like that i can i can sense it oh goodness that was truly amazing though that was super fun it was hard but we did it Right, we did it. <laughs> I used all my wig and weld. <laughs> all of it. Oh my god. There they are. The Ashwinders. Oh. Ah. They're against a troll. No! Oh. Incendio! Oh. oh god. Okay. You Now just finish. Oh Jesus. Oh my god. Quite conductive, you're done feeling our rage. Expulsion! 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 Here to show me some dark magic. Death from above! Expulsion! <laughs> I was about to, but I can't see shit, dude. Expulsion! Expulsion! 
you die. Explosion! Okay, at least they are not against Explosion. me right now. So there's that. Explosion! Oh goodness. Okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, that was not fair. Oh, it doesn't work, Expelliarmus, on him? Are you serious? I want to use, yeah, there we go. Oh my god, I am struggling. I am not struggling just just a little, eh? Jesus. Revelio. Uh okay. I need to stop playing. Let's finish this. I think I'm starting to get sick as well. I think I could unlock a couple of things collections or yeah talents okay i have a point oh i'm sorry <laughs> challenges no i don't have anything okay a talent that i could unlock so we have all these yeah that's crazy dude Okay, so I need to search the area. Oh my goodness! Wait, <laughs> what can I do for you? Ew. Uh, can't you? Okay. That's it. Oh God! This is Rockwood. I'll watch the light go out of your eye. Akio. Okay, I didn't mean to do that. Glacier. Oh, oh. Just warming up. Oh, oh. oh shit. You're going to regret that. You're only delaying the inevitable. <laughs> <laughs> I meant to do this. Goodness gracious. I had uh, quite the challenges today. It was very fun. I liked it a lot. But God. Mysterious and a bit unsettling. What to do? I retrieved the helmet from the Ash Wonders. <coughs> well done. I'm sorry. This is sure to impress Ranrock. The helmet shines even more brightly than I imagined. The etchings, the contour of the profile. Remarkable. It looks it looks like stunning, a Lord Gok. I see why you wanted it back. You did the thieves a service by recovering it. I know many a goblin who would have killed for it. Ah, oh, then I'm glad to be rid of it myself. Thank you. <laughs> this should earn Ranrock's trust. I will take it to him immediately. It may distract him from his search. His search? It, uh, it is merely an inkling. 
You have impressed me greatly, friend. I am glad that I trusted you. I'm not we sure I trust soon. you yet, though. Best to keep our arrangement quiet for now. Many will not believe that our aims might possibly be aligned. Yeah, yeah, we'll need to do these next time. Oh my god. <laughs> I think I have new uh, appearances, no? Don't I? I thought I did. I only have one to unlock and three here. God damn. Wait, we're almost done unlocking the... That's kind of cute. Unlocking the uh, the skins. This one is by far the best. <laughs> cute. God damn! I need to go to the rumor requirement. Is what I need to do. Uh, Hogwarts. We need to go here and brew some Wigan Well. Deke? Ah, Deke is so happy to see you. And Deke noticed this bag in the room the other day. You must need it to help with your schoolwork. Okay. Deke has seen one of these before. Deke calls it a knapsack. Perfect for gathering and transporting beasts. Wow. Pleasant little breeze. I have been thinking about something Professor Howen said in Beasts class, that I should study as many beasts as I can on my own time. Uh -huh. She also mentioned that poachers have been active in the area, so perhaps the beasts will be safer with us than out there on their own. Precisely what Deke was thinking. I can have, you I see, can have beasts. The room knew exactly what you needed. And luckily, Dee can show you how to best use the knapsack and where. Come along, I didn't then. mean to have a new quest right now. I need to end. I need to finish. Uh, okay. Stop. I wonder if you might stop by the three broomsticks when you can. I would like your help with something. As I okay. mentioned, my sister Anne misses Hogwarts. She hasn't been herself lately. I'd like to take you up on your promise to visit her with me. I'm heading to Feldcroft soon, so I'll look forward to seeing you there. It's just south of Hogwarts. By the way, hope you're faring well with the blasting curse. It's still one of my favorites. I like it too. Now that um, you've attended Beast's oh class, I've asked Deke to assist you in using the room to further your studies in that regard. Please meet him there when you can. I've already done that. I've not heard from my Uncle Roland in quite some time. I've been beside myself with worry. Could you meet me in the courtyard? I have way too many things to do. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh goodness. Oh goodness. I will be able to snatch <laughs> beasts and keep them? Is what I am understanding right now? Oh goodness. I can only do one each time. Yield one bottle. Mm. I have new stuff though. I have new stuff for the room of a requirement. Uh Oh, 
Oops. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. From tomes and scrolls, I need to purchase a T shaped. Okay, I need to go do that. Uh, I thought I had a couple of new things, but I think they're more in the um, I think it's more in the portraits and stuff like that, yeah. Maybe. Found in a chest scattered throughout the world, okay. I guess I don't have much. I have new stuff that I can use here. Identify. Looks really cool. Okay. So I got new... Oh goodness. Increased damage of all spells. Spells. Necromantic protection. Decreased damage taken from Inferi. Interesting. I kind of want to increase damage. You know, we'll go... Um, Full glass cannon. <sighs> okay. What about you? Laceration with defend though. I don't use it. Well, I use it, but not that much for all all spells is better i feel like i already have this one too okay this one i don't have okay so i can keep like this i think Combat. Oh. Protego shield in gear. Gear tree recipe. What is that? I mean, I understand what it is, but how do I apply it? <laughs> Amazing. How do I apply that to my gear? Let's see. <laughs> it's a recipe. It's not... I'm not sure yet. I guess the game hasn't shown me. How to put, for example, necromantic, uh, reduce damage from inferi, I'm guessing, is what it is, uh, to like the rest of my gear. How do I... How do I actually do that? I'm guessing the game will show me later. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna end it here because I'll never stop playing if I don't. Super, super, super fun. The challenges were really tough today and I need to get used to my... I'm still changing things out, you know, like my, my spell set. 
And I'm guessing I'm still, well, I'm still gonna get this one. And then there's like the unforgivable. But apart from that, we got only three left. And I mean, the flipendo, dude. I can't put all of them. You know what I mean? Like, I can't possibly, like, put all of them at all times, you know? I need to... Well, maybe I'll be able to... Oh, we have four left. We have Bombarda as well. I could put, like, Espeleomers here, but Bombarda here in the triangle. And then uh, we could put, instead of uh, the Pulso, we could put the Sando here. Something like that, but, like, I can't, I won't be able to put all of them. That's Transfiguration, right? Yeah. So I, I will need to choose, probably. Or I do a spell set for each. But I can only put four. You know, this one has five. So... I can't really... put everything. And then I need to change things up when I... go around. <laughs> I wish there were more. More, um... Spell sets possible. Anyways, I'm getting used to it. I'm getting used to what is where as well. I need to not change it up too much. <laughs> Cause that that gets hard. I should probably put Glacius with the Incendio one, just so I know Glacius is with Incendio. And then Levioso is with the Pulso, for example, or something like that, you know? I didn't even do the clock thing. I wanted to do the clock tower thing. <laughs> ah, there were too many things to do. Anyways, next episode is going to be crazy. I think we're going to do... Uh... Oh, We're going to definitely do... The beast, whatever thing, we're definitely going to do that next episode. But I would also like to do the Sebastian quest, dude. And maybe I'll keep... I'll keep the side quest for the live stream. Appearances, conjuration, spellcrafts. I definitely gonna do the Alohomora stuff for the stream. Uh, and then maybe the assignments, but... I really want to do this next time. The elf, the knapsack, and the loom. I'm so excited! I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode as much as I did. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!